just in this moment, just be aware of your body. Just naturally let your awareness be aware of your body. It's so natural. It's the most natural thing in the world for our awareness to be aware of our body. How we're sitting or lying down, how we're breathing, if there's any tensions, just notice how natural it is to be aware of your body. Your body can only be perceived because you are aware. You wouldn't know that you had a body if you didn't have awareness. Your body appears in your awareness. Your awareness does not appear in your body. So just rest in this awareness of your body. Allow your body just to be. Don't judge it. Don't try and change anything. You don't need to adjust anything. Just notice that you are aware of your body right now. Anything that arises in your awareness moves. Your body moves. Thoughts move. Feelings and perceptions and sensations move. But awareness itself is unmoving. It's always, always present. Because it's who you are. So thoughts will come, thoughts will go, feelings will arise and disappear, sensations of the body, sounds around you or sounds from the body, perceptions of touch or sight or smell or It all arises in awareness. There isn't a functioning of awareness itself. Awareness is all functioning from your mind and your body and your senses arise within your consciousness. Whatever appears, just let it appear. Whether it's a physical sensation, whether it's a thought, whether it's a feeling, let it appear and let it disappear. It's just movements. It's just functionings. It's like the current of the water. The current is not the water itself, yet it is the same material as the water. It is simply movement. So whatever arises, 
you don't have to follow it. You don't have to analyze it. You don't have to interpret it. You can just allow it to appear in your awareness and then disappear. Because if you don't start thinking about it or analyzing it or interpreting it, it will dissolve all by itself. When you don't touch what appears in your awareness, when you don't do anything about it, nothing can trouble you. Trouble and, tr and suffering only comes from analyzing, judging, wanting things to be different. If you can just notice what moves in your awareness without changing it, without wanting to, for it to be different, there is no suffering. You are the witness of all that comes and goes. You're here. You're neither in front of awareness or behind awareness. You are awareness itself. This is stillness here. You are the stillness. The stillness is the fragrance of yourself. It's naturally present. There's nothing to do to get it to be here. It's always here. It's your soul. It's your own being. As pure awareness, you have no self-image. Self-image is also an appearance in awareness. All your thoughts and ideas and what you've identified with through your life are all appearances in awareness. They come, they go, they change. Awareness itself never changes. It's image-less because it's not a thing. It's pure awareness. So when you don't create a relationship or an attachment to anything that appears in your awareness, it just comes and goes, everything that appears. Let it come, let it go. Notice that you are the stillness behind everything that comes and goes. The sense of coming and going is also appearances in you. You can notice them. They arise and then they disappear again. All your thoughts and feelings, perceptions and sensations moves into awareness. But awareness itself doesn't move. It's just aware of everything that arises. You are the witness to everything, even time. Awareness witnesses time. Time does not witness awareness. Stay with being. Stay with the stillness 
of who you are. Notice that that is the essence of your being, unmoving, whole. Can never be broken, can never be hurt. You are this immaculate awareness.